Ericsson, Garnacho hasn't stopped. Garnacho has scored in stoppage time. And Manchester United have nicked it. For updates in the world of football. For Liverpool, he's seen Henderson face to face with the Fernandinho. Henderson! Oh, wow! Lift the Anfield roof. Company's error, yes. Formula One. Here, Imkis down the inside now comes Carlos Sainz on Lewis Hamilton. Sainz just squeezes Hamilton, who goes over the rumble strip. Cycling, boxing. Basketball and lots more. Listen to us live on Sport Rush, Mondays to Fridays, 12 30 pm to 1 pm on Al Iyamoye TV Radio. For more inquiries, please call 006 242 9799. Sport Rush, your everyday dose of sports. This morning on Al Iyamoye TV and radio, now to mark day to our Muslim brothers and sisters. May this day bless you and uh, your, your families. Okay, I am yes, it's our aid. I'm sure only most you listen this part. Okay, it's good morning. Starting with uh, news of the day on Takeru Tomiyasu with Inter Milan has showed interest for. Let's not forget Takeru Tomiyasu joined Arsenal just last season, like when uh, uh, the likes of Fabio. And all oh, we're having beer and all oh, we're in January transfer, but for a target to Mars, who was at the beginning of the season, which he hasn't really played that much for us now. And now in Tamilan, uh, coming down for Takeru to me, as let's not forget in Tamilan, uh, we're also on for Larry Malone, mm-hmm. where they saw the deal wasn't favoring them and went for the Kamaka. And now they are coming down for Takeru to me, as yeah, you know, uh, I think it's high time Arsenal release uh, to me as because yeah. let's look at the options that Arsenal had at uh, in their squad. I uh, think that uh, player that can play from the right hand side and left hand side because most of uh, uh, to me as we play last season mostly from the left hand yeah, side, uh, le- the left the left back. Let's look at uh, Yuri Timba. Let's look at uh, Shisenko, uh, Tierney, and uh, Ben White. They have four options and him making the five option. Yeah, let's let's say it will be the fifth option for Arsenal. So I think for him to play better, it's high time for him to leave Arsenal and go. But I think uh, this guy is the authority will be missed uh, from Arsenal squad because he's a guy that doesn't relent easily. He, uh, you know, we know all this uh, Korea, all these Koreans and um, China, Japan, yeah. Japan player. They are no say die attitude. Look at Sonny Omi. Look at this impact then uh, with my with Master Naga. But on the other player we want to play, you don't want to be a, a sort of a even second feeding. You don't want to be a second player. You want just always want to be the first eleven player. And I think it it will, it will probably leave uh, us now. Okay. Uh news coming up now saying uh Bayern Munich and Inter Milan are still interested with uh, David Villa. Let's not forget, Lady David Villa parted with Manchester United. Inter Milan, we are on him, we are rejected the offer immediately. And now Inter Milan are still keen on uh, David Villa. Also, Bayern Munich, we are also thinking of going for the Moroccan uh, uh, goalkeeper from Sevilla. Yes, I don't know. Yes. Mm. I, I don't, he's a very, a very good goalkeeper. Even if, if I was asked to choose between Yasuno and David Villa. Yeah. I will just give us the Yazibono ahead of any big year. Not because of anything, because age is at the side of Yazibono, I think 28 years of age, compared to the year 33 years of, of, of age. And if David J joined Inter Milan, as I said last time, he will still play very well at, at Inter Milan. Because now, Inter Milan are with, uh, uh, not with uh, any goalkeeper now, Adam Milan has left uh, Inter Milan, uh, and Danovic as well has uh, 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 left Inter Milan as well. They need a very good goalkeeper, but my concern is would David the year stay in Europe hmm. will not be attracted by the huge money from Saudi that is where the question lies the, with the kind of experience that every year had in Europe I think he's still thinking 
whether to accept deal from Saudi because it's very it's too long for them to get to decide his, his future as it has been released uh, for manual since uh, Ju uh, Ju July 1st. It's been long. I think it's now it's trying to think uh, so much on his career, on his next move. And since the English of the year, my still go to Saudi Arabia to get which amount of money. But as a money to buy a I think he's a very good goalkeeper around. Buy a manager in Nigeria. Okay, now I'm moving to Chelsea. Would Levy Kui live up to the hype, the expectations people have on Levy Kui? Uh, you saw Brighton, they're interested in uh, swapping Levy Kui for Moises Caicedo. But then, where Chelsea immediately rejected the offer of swapping, but wanted to buy in whole assets. Now, with Levy Kui, live up to expectations as Chelsea would believe him to do. Um. Lavi I think is very good goalkeeper, a very good uh, player, a defender, a young lad, twenty years of age, and I think uh, uh, um, the coach of Brighton, Roberto De Zerbi, he knows what he want, he know what what, what Lavi can do. Mm. That is why he's insisting on Chelsea to bring in Lavi Kowi and put money on, on, on him to get uh, Moses Caicedo. And I think Chelsea will not make that mistake. They are, they are even, he has even signed a big contract, and I think the expectation from this uh, player. I think it will perform even more than expectation because I think Thomas Tuchel made a mistake. He made the mistake of not giving this guy at least his debut. I can remember when he, 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 he first played for Chelsea. There was there was this uh, pundit that said, "This guy is calm as the Ferdinand." Get just at all because it now depends on the performance of Kepa and yeah, Balaga. Yeah. If Kepa and Balaga does very well, maybe in the, in, 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 in the next five games or six games for Chelsea, it will be difficult for Tanchet to, to, to get. And Adam Chelsea is going to Champions League or any other competition, I will say there will be change in votes. I still say Kepa at the at the, the, the side and the, uh, right in the central defense side. I say uh, Thiago Silva and Lewis Kowi. I see them both pairing together. On the left hand side, I see I see Ben Chua. Ben Chua still being on the left hand side. Right hand side, I see uh Miss James, yeah. Mr. Reliable, is very reliable. And when you are talking about the attack, defense, is very reliable for Chelsea, no doubt about that. Now if Muscado comes in, I see Moses Caicedo, I see Enzo Fernandez. I see Moses Caicedo, Enzo Fernandez. And I, I, I see someone in, in, in front of them, which is Christopher Kuku. 
most most of the games go and go lost to play most is to play behind the striker. Whereby you have the chance to move inside the box. Maybe he scored the rebound or he scored second feeding crew. Most of the game is play he played in his position are mostly from the eighth position, ten position, or the left hand side. So you look at the formation where they play against uh, uh Borussia Dortmund. I think the coach experiment in. He played the in and Pochettino said something. He's trying to mirror the, the player that he, his plan that can start the game against Liverpool next week. So he has given us clue on how he wanted to start next season. So I say, uh, 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 Christopher Nkuku, uh, if Chelsea are unable to bring in uh, Moses Casado, I still say, either I say Andre Santos, I say, oh, uh, it's Fernandez, or Galaga. Let's say Galaga, it's Galaga, it's Fernandez. And uh, uh, Christopher Nkoko. And in the fourth line, I see uh, Nicholas Jackson. The left hand side as well, I still see uh, uh, this guy. I see this guy from there. Uh, Maduke is, is out in Georgia, has not been playing uh, for chasing the position. So I see Stelly starting from the right hand side. And I see uh, uh, Michael Ludwig starting from the left hand side as well. Chelsea are good to go. They are good to go. Okay. Or it's possible, it's possible we see a Matson, a young lad. We see, we see him from the right hand side, and whereby Sterling has not been a good in position. And I don't, I don't really blame uh, the coach not starting him because I believe a player not having form in position doesn't mean you not have the form. Uh, and don't forget, they are going to play against Liverpool. They need a lot of experienced players, so it's still possible we see Ian Martin and Raheem uh, Sterling and using Michael Mudrik as a joker to bring him on to come and cause interview to Liverpool uh, defense. Okay. Let's take a short break from here. When we get back uh, from the break, I will continue on the rumors and transfer going on around. Do stay with us. Thank you. Thousands have been disappointed in the big greener pasture abroad. So those quack in the trap, it is a sign. That is not our case. Successfully, without stress, help you process and secure you to anywhere in the world. To residential, huh? visiting and tourism visa, student visa, Europe, Africa. It's no big deal. It's a body for us. Let's process and secure say Canada within a twinkle of this to our. Muslim, what are you waiting for? Consult us at number nine, South South Central Mall, Shalaka Street, behind Royal Hotel, 0802 733 Stop wasting money, travel. Wala fe tu bayi, so fe wo shu Zayana Zayana Out of Zayana, when we talk of top notch materials and clock Zayana, let him out, you know what talk you get And Malaysia clothes, Dubai, I want design bags, no rishi rishi I want it to let Bata 21 for what, Regina she I want go ka jo, ton ka wakat yo jo Kan to be re, look ba Mudebe, Ojo means she kami 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 a mini ra, a mini moon, bogey musulu, me a lesson, the bogey, bonk pa fashion, the one in Lujala, be a bayal rich, house three go buera, house of fifty two. I just sent read Paris. Along show where Bell puts a lorry inside six eight eight six one Ziana. Late I just sat into Julo Washo at in Quasha. Benini bogo yito Fe wo sho yi Sho geto pa gba mo Ow
if Barcelona are eventually reach an agreement with Man City, and I think our Joan Castle is very, very good at defender, but not that good in Vesey Lee. When he's attacking, he's very good at attacking. And don't forget, he's a utility player as well. It can be used from the uh, as center back as well. It can be used from the uh, left uh, left back as well. But if Barcelona brings him in, he will surely play from the other side for Barcelona. And Araujo, I said something yesterday, Araujo will move back to center. It will not be Araujo and Jusconde, Bade. Araujo, Jusconde, Bade, Cancelo. You, where where Araujo will be, will, will be okay for Barcelona is to play from the right hand side. So that if Cancelo needs to attack, you know he always loves attacking, Araujo can't go to the right hand side to help, not to fill uh, the, the, uh, the, the space um, for Joao Cancelo. I'm making Uri uh, uh, Romeo to drive back. To come and support uh, Juskundi, you know, Ori Romero is very, very good at defensive midfield. He can always play, play as a centre back as well. Coming back uh, uh, to come and support uh, Juskundi at the back, and I think if Barcelona are getting this guy, they had problem in the right hand side. Don't forget last season Juskundi played mostly uh, from the right hand side. But in a uh, classical, they have around you playing there because of Vinicius Junior. But now if they are playing against um, Real Madrid in the classical, you can't expect. Uh, Castellano to play for the Atlanta because they know the damage Vinicius can cause uh, to Barcelona. Mm -hmm. And you can move back there and they have uh, Christensen and Jusconde, uh, uh, um, or they have Inigo in, in Martinez, yeah. the guy from Athletic Bilbao. So I think if Barcelona are getting this guy, they are getting very good, a good, a good player with experience, with the amount of experience. And don't forget, they have Igago Rodan, they still have Igago Rodan, and they, they play together at Man City. So they are getting experienced player, cheap player as well. Cheap players, well. don't forget the kind of performance he has for, for, for Bayern Munich is not that good or super. So that's the reason why they are getting him for the likes of him. If Barcelona is interested in signing him, I think he's a very, very good uh, player. And Sadio Hernandez is getting what he wants from the right hand side. Okay, on guessing, you mean at Barcelona to Al Ali? Profitable move for, for Barcelona. Barcelona. Because we don't, we, we don't forget this guy left um, AC Milan on a free transfer. I, I, I just, I just. Imagine the kind of business uh, Barcelona are doing in this summer. Don't forget the deal between PSG and uh, Barcelona on Usman Dembele. Is that, that getting uh, uh, discussed today, maybe final day today? And don't forget, they sell Usman Dembele on the free transfer. Also from Dortmund. No, not from Dortmund. He joined from Dortmund. His contract expired. And in the beginning of the last season, he joined on the free transfer. Don't forget, uh, uh, Thomas Tuku wants to bring in. Osman Dembe on the free transfer to Chelsea. But when he was on free transfer, he needed to sat, sat himself down and Tavi convinced him a lot. You know, they brought in Rafinha. When they know the, 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 the future of Osman Dembe is uncertain, he's on free transfer. And at the end of the day, they agreed on a two years deal. He joined them in the free transfer. Now they're selling him to 50 million euros. That's profit from there. Look at Frank Casey. Yes. He joined from AC Milan on a free transfer as well. Now they are getting like 15, 20 million pounds on this guy. I think there's someone cooking something for Barcelona behind because financially they are not okay. And if they could get money from uh, Osman Dembele, get money for uh, yes. Frank Casey. Please. We all know if they said Dembele, they need another player to replace Osman Dembele. Now, they got some money from from Casey. They don't need anybody to replace from Casey. They've already got him only remove. It's as it's, it's as if they, they know that from Casey will leave. That's how they get they get uh Uri Romeo. He's a very good player as well. So I think Barcelona are, are doing a good very very good business now. This compared to uh, past, we are they always just bringing player with I uh, with uh, with I I money. Okay, on uh Barcelona rivals uh Real Madrid. If you look at their last performance in their preseason games, you saw a lot of chances. For them, someone even made a comment on Real Madrid Barcelona saying Real Madrid were playing a crossbar challenge. Uh, it's in almost like 10 or 9 balls on the crossbar, and also against Juventus uh, yesterday, where they were in the great 33 1. You see this as uh, uh, maybe Real Madrid losing in their efficiency, or they are just waiting for them to enter the La Liga. I'll stick on them to say it. You can't take a striker. Out of football, it's not possible. Pep Guardiola has tried it. He tried it. He succeeded maybe two, three years. 
months, four, five years, and he ended up doing a failure. He came to Man City. He had a uh, 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 conundrum. He still says that he doesn't want to be a striker. Don't forget that Ibrahimovic at Barcelona. Ibrahimovic came from Inter Milan, and then you are starting on bench. How are you using Sanchez as a first nine? Fabregas as his first nine. It does the same thing as uh, 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 Bayern Munich. Yeah. But Bayern Munich, about Lewandowski changed its overtones a little bit. You know, you have, you don't have any, any, anything that will use about Lewandowski. But sometimes it changes the formation and use uh, Thomas Muller as first nine sometimes. But at, 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 at Man City, early but Ireland changed the orientation of Pep Guardiola. When you are, you know, when you, when you want to, when you want to have a good chance in the team, you need to convince such a coach that you are very good at what you use how to do it. Brian Madrid has made a, a lot of mistakes, not replacing Karim Benzema. Dosilo is not the kind of player that you can use to replace Ben Karim Benzema. It's quite quite different. It's like you 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 want to replace Kylian Mbappe, and you went ahead to go and bring Olise. You want to replace Kylian Mbappe. You went ahead to go and bring Ryan Stene. You want to replace Ellie but Alan. You want to go and bring a player that doesn't even score half of goal for Ellie but Alan. How many goals did Joseph score for Espanyol last season? How many goals? Don't forget, Karim Benzema is the is the only player that has won most trophies for Real Madrid. And Real Madrid went. Uh, they, 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 yeah, it, it was even Benzema that make Real Madrid to be like this because he doesn't even give them any chance as he's leaving Real Madrid. It was after they, they, they paid for the Bellingham, 100 million. That is when Gary Benzema said, is that that item they need to go to Saudi Arabia to get money? And I still think the summer transfer is, uh, has not end. Most of the responsibility for by, by Real Madrid is being cheated on this guy, Felix Jr. And don't forget, the solution might not, it might, it might not live up to expectation next season because the current amount of volume of goals that will be that will put on this guy will be too much. He would not be eager to score. Don't forget, last season, he's not that eager to score, but goals always come for Professor Junior. So next season, Real Madrid, I think as an issue, should think very, very well. And Real Madrid, hierarchy as well, they are very careful not to bring in a striker. That will disturb the team. Don't forget, as what is leaving the team next season. A new coach will come in, will demand for a new striker. And the eyes are still on Kylian Mbappe. Even though they play John, they still need a clinical goal scoring striker. Look at Barcelona, they have Robert Lewandowski to score goal. They have a great deal for this guy who have Toroku. Where is a clinical goal scoring striker for Real Madrid? I think it will cause concern necessary for Real Madrid. Okay, we come to the end of sports vibe today on the Adiki Jamoe TV and radio. Don't forget to like, follow, and comment, and share all our programs on Facebook at Jamoe TV Radio and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I remain, yes, it's our easy. I'm sure I'm sure they're sending this for us. Tell you a good bye. bye.